What is up everybody? NT Certified here and I got something in the mail yesterday from a good friend of mine. Got this box. I know that there's games inside of it and I know what these games are but I think there's a few surprises in this box as well. So let's get the unboxing going. Let's go. Before we begin, do not forget to subscribe to the channel, become a part of the Certified Club. We do multiple videos a week, we do wrestling, we do video games, we do video game streams, and we do everything else in between. Become a part of the movement. So this box comes all the way from Hawaii from a good friend of mine named Travis. Thank you for sending me the box. I really do appreciate it. And while you're here, everybody go check out his channel. His channel is Aloha Trav. That is A-L-O-H-A-T-R-A-V. And the screenshot is up in the corner. Check out his channel. He is the biggest Street Fighter fan that I know. So definitely go and check him out. What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? All right, so the box is open. Let's take a look and see what we got. So this is pretty cool. Got me a new Lawbreakers cap. Actually, this is my second Lawbreakers cap. I have another Lawbreakers cap that I got from E3, which is all black, and this is black and red. This is pretty, this is pretty darn cool. Thanks for the hat. It's nice. I have to wear that in one of my future videos. Let's go, let's go to the bottom. Let's go to the bottom before we get to the games. Wait a second. Wait one minute. What is this? What's this bad boy? And it's completely sealed. I don't even want to open it. This is nice. This is nice. And it's my size. Open this bad boy up. Wow, check this out. This is a Street Fighter V t-shirt in large. This is my size and it has Ryu on the front. Very nice, very nice. I am wearing this bad boy this weekend. This is really, really cool. Thank you so much. Wait, what the heck is this? This is different. PS3 game called The Shoot. Uh, something that works with the PlayStation Move. The PS Move is required for this game. I've never heard of this before. So I'm guessing it's like a, a Wild Wild West, uh, judging by the front of the case. It's like some type of like Wild Wild West, uh, similar to like a, uh, what's the, what's the game that I'm thinking about? Similar to, uh, oh my gosh, not Time Splitters, but like, um, you know those games like uh, House of the Dead you know where the zombies or you know somebody comes up across the screen and you have to shoot them because you're using the move controller this is what this game is um, use pinpoint accuracy and motion tracking of the move controller to blast your way through highly destructible action movie sets okay different I've never heard of this game so this is this is pretty cool thank you nice nice this is Rayman Origins for the PS Vita. This is so cool. This is super cool, super cool. So as you know, I've been collecting my PS Vita games from Limited Run and I don't have a PS Vita to play them on. Uh, so I'm just collecting my games. And, and this Rayman Origins is a classic game. Like this game got rave reviews, it's amazing, it's it's the perfect platformer, you know? And and Rayman has kind of stood the test of time. So I'm very excited to have this. When I do get another PS Vita, definite plan this bad boy. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Super R-Type 3 for the SNES. Do you know how amazing this game is? Super R-Type is an amazing, amazing game. Um, this is the third in the series. Um, I actually watched a video from, 
uh, was it RGT85 maybe? Uh, he just got one of these from Retrobit, uh, but this is the freaking original. This is the original right here. So if you don't know what Super R-Type is, um, it's a side-scrolling shooter. Uh, it's a shoot 'em up or shmup, whatever you call them. Um, but it's it's a it's really fun. It's a lot of fun to play. Uh, not too much different from Super R-Type 2. Uh, just some some small like minor improvements. But any type of like side-scrolling shooter. Like, I just absolutely love those types of games, especially on the SNES. I had a bunch of them as a kid uh, when I had my original SNES, but I wound up giving it away to a kid that was needy because I got a new system. I think that was a Nintendo 64. So I missed out on a lot of those games that I could have collected, but I'm starting to get everything back. And this is a great piece of my collection, and it is in tip top shape like this bad boy is clean wow this is <laughs> this is nice this is so nice this is a sealed copy sealed copy of metal gear solid 4 guns of the patriots on the ps3 this is the limited edition this is a fat box to fit on my shelf what comes in here all right, so this comes with Metal Gear Solid 4, the actual game. Uh, it comes with a DVD, a Blu-ray disc, uh, with two hours of additional content, behind the scenes vision of the production team and the making of the game. And it also comes with the music CD with 16 unreleased tracks. This is solid. This is very, this is very, very nice. I am not even gonna open this. I'm not gonna open this. This is a collector for sure and uh, very happy to have it. So we got two games left and I know what they are and I am super excited. We are gonna start with the Sega Genesis. This is Lightning Force Quest for the Dark Star. Now, you know where I said Super R-Type was a really good game? Lightning Force is just as good, if not better, than Super R-Type. <laughs> These side-scrolling shooters are amazing games. So, you may know this game as Thunder Force and then brought it over to the States. It's now Lightning Force. They did change around the name a little bit, so it's L-I-G-H-T-E-N-I-N-G Force. So it's different from the normal spelling of Lightning, but the game itself is amazing and this is complete this comes with the manual and it comes with the actual cartridge itself I mean this is this is crazy this is crazy this is an amazing game it's hard to play uh, it does have a high difficulty level and that's just the way that some of these games were and that's what what makes it even more challenging you know makes you want to come back and, and play it all the way through so another great game going to my collection <laughs> thanks again this is super castlevania 4 one of the best castlevanias ever this game got rave reviews rave reviews so in this game you are simon and you are going through 11 worlds to try and take down count dracula this game is a classic it's a classic and it's actually in the actual box which is amazing the original plastic is still around it uh, which is cool and it even has the KB toy sticker of $22.99 on the actual package but this game is worth a lot more than $22.99 just look it up uh, this this is a classic and I'm super happy to have this in my collection and I need to stream some of these games I need to get into this I need to get into this retro streaming because this is amazing this is amazing. Great game. Classic. Love it. Thank you. And that completes my box. Some great titles in there, some great add-ons. Very, very surprised uh, at the extras that came in the box. So once again, thank you to Travis and everybody else. Thank you for watching. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate you guys. Do not forget to like, comment, subscribe, follow me on social media, donate to the channel. Feel free to just let yourself loose. <laughs> Until next time, this is NT Certified.
peace.